Pope Francis made the decision to canonize Mother Teresa because she symbolized a true servant who throughout her life paid and gave everything for the poor. There were two types of controversy that arose in the media around her becoming a saint. One was about the care that people in her hospices in India received and whether or not that care was appropriate. When you, I think when you look at the large scope of the good that she did in the event that there were people that maybe should have gone to a hospital but did not, or there were people who felt pressured in a Catholic institution, whether they were Catholic or not, I think one of the keys about Mother Teresa is the people who she was serving. She was serving the people, primarily serving people who no one else wanted to serve. The fact that she devoted her life for the poor, for Pope Francis, was one of the most important reasons why he wanted to make sure that we redefined what constitutes a saint today. Personally, coming from me, I pray to Mother Teresa every day, and I know that the miracles that aren't proven or shown aren't true, but I truly believe that people who pray for her do get signs from her, and I think that could be a miracle as well. And I had an experience of that in Gallup, New Mexico. We were doing a service project with the Navajo Nation, and we went down and worked for a day with Mother Teresa's sisters in their soup kitchen, and we were making vegetable soup. The vegetables, so some of the corn was rotten and it had mold growing on it. And we were responsible for going through and finding the corn that didn't have mold on it and peeling it and making it for, for soup. And we were throwing the pieces that had the mold in the trash can naturally. And one of the sisters came along and she said, no, the half of the corn that doesn't have mold is still good to use and we have to use it because we serve the people at our soup kitchen who no one else will serve at their soup kitchen. So it was the bottom of the bottom of the bottom who was being served by Mother Teresa's sisters in Gallup. Of course we wish that wasn't the case but throughout the country and throughout the world it seems that Mother Teresa's sisters are taking care of people that no one else wants to be engaged with someone who surrendered her life and offered everything that she had to bring dignity and alleviation uh, of the difficulties of uh, poverty to people in Calcutta and in many other places of the world. The other controversy is one that will always be associated with miracles. And basically, what a miracle is, is that for a faith-based person, it's saying that this healing is, an, is a divine, is a result of divine intervention. She is one of the greatest humanitarians that stands out in the 20th century. Everything that she has done in this world has made a big impact between all the third world countries and everything. If Mother Teresa is not an icon, uh, of what it means to truly be a saint. Uh, I don't really think I understand what sainthood is.